Hi, I'm here to show you how to access your Virgin Media mailbox using our webmail service. With our webmail service, you can access your inbox quickly, easily, and from wherever you are in the world. So first, get online and open an internet browser. By the way, some mobile and older desktop browsers won't be able to access our webmail service, so make sure that your browser is supported. Type in virginmedia.com. Now click the link for email in the top right hand corner. This will take you through to the sign in screen. Enter your My Virgin Media username and password. And remember that your username might be different to your email address. If you can't remember your My Virgin Media username or password, please follow the links on the screen for help. Once you've entered your details, click sign in. You'll now be taken to your inbox. In your inbox, you can click on any of your messages in the middle of the screen and the content will be displayed on the right hand side. You can forward, delete or reply to any of your messages by clicking on the options at the top. Messages can be moved to folders which are listed on the left hand side of the screen. If your mailbox was migrated from the Virgin Media mailbox service provided by Google, then all emails from before the migration will be listed in the Gmail or Google Mail folder. There's a search option available in the left hand column to help you find messages in the folder selected. I'm now going to send an email. To create a new email, select the Compose link. Enter the email address or contact name if you already have this saved in the To field. Drag and drop attachments from your computer's folders into the grey box on the left hand side. If you're not ready to send, you can save your emails as a draft by clicking the Save button. The draft is then stored in your drafts folder, ready to send at a later date. Once you're ready to send your email, just click the send button in the top right hand corner. To make sending emails easier, you can save email addresses and other details for people you frequently contact. To do this, you simply click on the address book and select new and then add contact. Enter the relevant information and click save once you're finished. All your contacts will be listed on the contacts page. You can also import contacts from your computer by clicking this icon and selecting import. You can change the way you access your email via webmail by clicking the cog button and selecting settings. Here you can add a signature, set up filters to manage your messages or set up forwarding. If you want any more details on this or any other features in Virgin Media's webmail including supported browsers then please visit our help and support site virginmedia.com forward slash help. I hope this has been helpful for you.